Hello everybody, welcome back to Skyrim, the Anniversary Edition, our Orc uh, Berserker playthrough. Uh, so, right now, our quest, uh, where we ended off with the last episode, is with the Daedric quest, Ill Met by Moonlight, where we talk to a werewolf named Sinding, who the Daedric Lord here seen has punished by preventing his transformations. He's given me the ring he stole and asked me to entreat her scene for forgiveness so we are on our way to kill a uh, a great beast that whoa what the fuck just happened you guys see that that was some some old skyrim bugs that was crazy all right we're getting close uh we're gonna hop off and uh try to i mean we're not really a sneaky character i guess that's not really the way to go do i why do i have my fists out what's going on here i want this out all right, we got some bandits up here we got to take care of first. What's my difficulty at? I feel like I changed it since I last played. Yep, all right. We'll bump that up to expert for now. All right. Oh, shit, there's a wolf? What's the wolf doing? It's running away. All right. That, oh, there's another wolf. That one. Oh, it's attacking Lydia. Lydia, no! Nice. Oh, shit. Get behind the trees, Lydia. Don't don't attack until you can see the white of their eyes. All right. Let's get in there. Do some, some orc parkour is what they call this. You may not know this, but orcs are very proficient in the art of parkour. I'm fucking blocking all your arrows, dude. You ain't shit. Your friend over here thinks he's shit, though. And he's not. Whoa! What the fuck is going on? <laughs> Hold on. I need to hit something real quick because I feel like my attacks are lagging like crazy for some reason. Lydia, are you attacking my horse? What is your fucking problem? All right. Uh, what? Wait, did my quest marker move? It's moving. I need to attack something because I want to see if my game is fucking up. I don't see why it would. I, I feel like every time I get rid of mods that that seem to be fucking up the game, it fixes it and works fine. And then I reload a game like a few days later and it's fucking up again. I, uh, I don't get it. I'll get it. So, uh, I hope that this isn't going to be fucked up. We'll see, though. We have to approach this, uh, this great beast of the wilderness. Probably could have got back on my horse. What's my horse's name? Thunder? Thunder! Thunder, hail boy! Hail boy, come here. Hello, Thunder, my beautiful child. I'm gonna hop on you and we're gonna we're gonna go kill this thing. It's right here. I did not need to get on my horse. Oh shit, we're in hot pursuit. Hot pursuit thunder. Move like thunder, but or no, move like move like lightning, attack like thunder. That doesn't make any fucking sense. Move like thunder, attack like lightning. I don't fucking know. Lightning's fast. So I want to move like lightning, but lightning is also what does the damage. So I want to attack like lightning. I want to move and attack like lightning. God, this deer is fucking fast. I don't think I've ever tried to kill it like this. This is this is interesting. Not fast enough. All right, all right. Now we gotta talk to this ghost deer. Hello. Hello. 
Clement, are uh, are you here seen? All right, cool. Um, will you remove the curse from this ring? Where are you going? Where are you going? This is awkward. You're trying to leave while we're talking. Uh, hmm. Would my character, I mean, orc berserker, orcs tend to worship a daedric god. Where is this fucking ghost deer going? He's just walking out of my vision. All right. Goodbye. I guess I'll talk to your, your dead body. <laughs> Uh, I feel like maybe my character would go for it. Yeah, uh, it shall be done as you ask. Okay. Where'd it go? God, that thing just fucking wandered into the water. What is it doing? That was weird. All right, begin the hunt. So that is taking me pretty much around this body of water and I got to swing all the way around there. So I pretty much just got to follow this road until I hit this cave. That's not that hard. That shouldn't take too long. Thunder, we ride. Lydia, you, you walk. <laughs> I should really need to get Lydia a horse because this is kind of disrespectful. Lydia has done no wrong to Grishka yet. My other playthrough, Lydia was kind of dumb, but... Lydia, steal, steal that horse. I'm sure they won't mind. There's no one around. I'm sure you could take that horse and, and no one would give a fuck. Am I going the right way? Uh, yes, I just want to keep straight. I want to keep true, as they say. I guess there wasn't really a straight option, but I need to go this way. I wonder what kind of dangers we're going to run across. I'm... I'm digging the vibe that the weather's giving me, but god damn, this rain is loud. <laughs> oh shit, what's the deal with this? This looks like a, a challenger. Possibly. It's another orc. Are you a berserker like me? You don't look like it. You shouldn't talk to me like that. No, I'm going to fuck you up. And if you don't want that to happen, you better back off. Oh, you don't have to take that from me? That's what you fucking think. Dude, what is going on? You see my attacks? They're like fucking missing. What the hell? <laughs> I really have to figure that out. That's that's really weird. What if I switch weapons? What if I go to the Orcish Battle Axe? I feel like we're skipping frames every time I fight, but... I don't know. I, I feel like that shouldn't be happening the way it is. Let's kill this fox. Normally, I wouldn't just run up and kill a fox. Oh, shit. I am sorry, fox. I did... <laughs> Lydia's gonna go finish that off, apparently. Um, where's Thunder? Thunder! Thunder, we ride. Oh, shit. I heard wolves. Thunder, we don't ride. We we defend. We fight for our life. Wherever the fuck these wolves are. I know I heard some. Where'd Lydia go? Lydia just kind of wandered off into the rain chasing after a fox. She's a, she's a little, there you are. She's, she's a little special up in the, up in her mind. Oh, there's another fox. Lydia, don't go chasing that, please. She has like shiny red ball syndrome where she just like sees something that she really wants and just chases after it to, chases after it endlessly. To the ends of the earth and back. All right.
right. So let's see here. We are, well, we just crossed that little pond. All right. So that was the, what, the bridge? Ah, that bridge was not marked on the map. So that's kind of annoying. It's a little annoying in my opinion. Put the bridges on the maps, you know? I can't see a thing. Like, I can't really see that far ahead. What's this dude's problem? I don't think he's going to attack me. Whoa, thunder, calm down. Hello, sir. Oh, it's a courier. All right, no worries, bro. You, you get back to your duties. I will uh, I will get back to mine. I have to go kill a, a werewolf for for a demon god. So, you, you know, we both have... We're, we're, we're both the same, essentially. You have your notes to deliver. I have my werewolves and gods to kill and please, you know? You and I are <laughs> one si two different sides of the same coin, essentially. All right, we are approaching the cave. Yeah, I knew this wouldn't be that far of a ride. Only about like five minutes or so. It looks like the rain is letting up. That's nice. Rained pretty much all of our journey here, except for right when we get here. Now, if you do come to this cave prior to... I don't know if it's prior to starting this quest. At least it's like before sending escape. So I guess, yeah, that would be right when you start the quest. Um, so prior to starting this quest, if you go to this cave, there is a actually a um, a rare weapon in here. I don't remember what it's called, but it's it's a blade sword, uh, and uh, it's it's kind of cool. If you if you're like a collector in this game, uh, I was when I uh, first played. I collected every like specially named weapon there was, anything that was like. Uh, unique. I would collect every little bit. Yeah, this place is kind of cool. It's very orange, red. Where's the moon? Holy shit, look how big that is. Oh my god. Let's go talk to this here, Khajiit. Uh, what happened here? And he's dead. That was dramatic. I feel like he's faking it. Wake up! Wake up! Sir! I gotta d d take that off so I can shake him. Still can't shake him! Whatever. I don't need your iron sword. I was gonna shake you to see if you were awake, but... I guess he is dead. He's really fucking heavy. Alright. You got gold. You got gold. You also got a potion. That's nice. Wait, was that a chest? No. No, I don't know what I was seeing. I think there might be something down here. Yep, there's a chest. Steel soldier gauntlets. What am I wearing right now? Steel soldier armor. And brawler's iron gauntlets. Okay. Um. Yeah, go ahead and put those on for now. I don't think I'm going to be fighting bare-fisted. Or not bare-fisted, but I'm not going to be fist-fighting these fuckers. Oh, hello. I got to get closer. I've been told to kill you. I always hated this um, ultimatum, like choosing to save him versus kill him. Because if you spare his life, like, yeah, you get Hirsing's ring. But if you're not a werewolf, it's useless. And he says he can be a powerful ally, but that's only in the scenario of this quest. He doesn't become a follower, and I always found that kind of annoying. Um, I'm actually going to show you a way to get both. Uh, Daedric Artifacts, if it still works. Uh, 
So tell him you will spare his life. I will spare your life. We hunt together, brother. <laughs> there's also a sprig I'm about to pop out right here. Quick save. Um, there's a way to get both uh, Daedric artifacts. Oh, I guess the sprig and not going to pop out. Could have sworn there was. Oh, what's up, dude? Like I was just talking normally. But then, like, later in the Companions questline, Ayala doesn't talk to you at all when she's in her wolf form. This dude's clearly very good at being a werewolf. Dude, look at our fucking party right now. We got... We got... We got, Lit, we got Lydia... Lydia, the ditzy warrior. We got Sending, the the like really talented talking werewolf, and we got Hilda, the badass fucking goat that carries all my shit. And me, orc barbarian or not barbarian, orc uh, berserker. Hello, dude. Rissing. Get oh damn here scene, or not here scene sending. God damn it. Good night, bud. What do you got? You got anything good? You got two gold. Oh, we got two gold. Also, just having this guy on your team versus trying to fight him, especially at a lower level like me, that's a bad time. Oh shit, sending, sending, get in there, fuck him up. Holy shit, Lydia. We're just dicking on this man. I'm trying not to hit sending to piss him off. Alright, this guy. Quit running away. <laughs> Torkel the fearsome is running away in fear. That doesn't even make sense. Holy shit, that dude just got launched. Alright, this is a chick. A girl. A woman who is now dead, but yeah. Is that all of them? I think so. I guess we still have a bit to go. All right, we're, we're, we're still moving. There's probably some more. There is more. All right. Come and get some, bitch. I'm going to enter my Berserker Rage real quick. Hello. I'm coming at you swinging. That's all of them. Alright. Let me get rid of my Berserker Rage here. Let me quick save again. You never know what's going to happen. So, uh, here we go. Alright. So, talk to Sending. The last of the hunters is, are dead. It's not last of the hunters is dead. That's improper grammar. All right. So quest is done. What the fuck? Oh, right. Okay. You got to kill him first. Uh, so after you finish the quest, kill him. This is going to be really difficult. Holy shit. Uh, oh God. All right. Um, we're going to want to load him up with some poison, I guess. Oh my God. This is not going to be a fun time. <laughs> I hope that this goes okay. He's running away. Lydia, stop him. Fuck. Lydia, catch him. He's running away like a little fucking werewolf bitch. Come here. You missed. Got him. All right. And now you want to tear the skin from Sending's body. I did as you asked.
Thank you, Hersine. Are we, are we done here? Okay. I was about to say, he wouldn't let me leave. All right. And now you can leave the cave. And this is how you get both, um, both artifacts. I don't have both yet. But once you leave the cave, you get, you get the other artifact. Ending with both artifacts. If it still works. Which I don't see why it wouldn't still work. So we, we will see. The only reason I think it would not work is the mod I have, which is the unofficial Skyrim patch, which patches like bugs here and there. So I don't know if that would change anything, um, but we're, I guess we're about to find out. So here we go. Mm. All right. So I guess the either they patched it out with the anniversary edition or it's patched with the mod I have. If you do it that way, you, at least in the old version, you were able to get both uh, the ring and um, Savior's Hide. But whatever, we I didn't want the ring anyway. We got Savior's Hide increases magic resistance by fifteen percent, increases poison resistance by fifty percent. Throw that bad boy on. Oh, we're looking fucking beefy. All right. What's our... There's a lot of foxes over here. Hello. That's not a fox. And it's raining again. Why is it always raining? I don't like the sound. I heard the wolf howl and it stopped howling. That's it's got to be a bad sign, right? All right, whatever. What quest do we have? Um... Yeah, fuck that quest. I'm not an idiot. All right, I was just in Falkreath. Let's go do that. Let's go fast travel back to Falkreath and go check out what this is. I think in the next episode, we will try to progress a little further into the main storyline. Maybe go to... Uh, I don't think I've gone to the Greybeards yet. Yeah, I haven't gone to the Greybeards yet. So maybe uh, next episode, we will venture up to High Hrothgard and talk to those... Uh, those those old geezers and learn more about our dragonborn abilities what time is it 6 a.m all right we're gonna wait a couple hours uh get everyone up and at them man it's either raining or foggy as shit i'm honestly about to just get rid of this weather mod like it's nice for aesthetic also forgot to turn my fucking brightness up Luckily, I haven't been in any caves or anything. There we go. Um, the weather mod just like kind of hinders it for videos, I feel. It's a nice aesthetic, and I enjoy it while I play, but god damn, this is annoying when I record. There's a dead Khajiit. All right. There's also a coffin with a note, letter from Irwin. All right, well, let's, uh, let's check this out first. Khajiit's note. All right, we're going to take your stuff real quick. All righty. Do you not have a name? Khajiit finally got a lead on Edward. It seems he and his bandit friends fled north to Skyrim. But when he spoke to the guard captain, he tells Khajiit the bounty on Edward has already been claimed. A ripe old adventurer showed up to the barracks on a horse, dragging the Breton's corpse up behind him. They tell Khajiit the body is buried at the far end of the cemetery in Falkreath. Khajiit will take a shovel and dig him up. After all, there are ways to die and not be dead. Khajiit has heard of potions that mimic death, slowing the heart to barely beat. If so, then Edward might still be out there. To that end, this one has heard rumors of a bandit wearing Daedric plate but plying his body time. God, I can't fucking read. <laughs> To, the, to, to that end, this one has heard rumors of a bandit wearing Daedric Plate plying his blood trade at Knife Point Ridge. Originally, Khajiit did not think Edward the type to live in an abandoned mine, but how he is not so sure. But now he is not so sure. God, dude, this fucking font is, is atrocious. Edward may have fooled the guard, but Khajiit won't believe he is truly dead until he sees it with his own eyes. I get you're trying to make it look like someone wrote this with a fucking feather, but sometimes I, like, can't fucking read this. Like, I feel like I'm reading hieroglyph hieroglyphics. 
from time to time. Like, Jesus Christ. All right. Uh, this is the place he dug up. Letter from Irwin. Dear brother, are you well? I heard this terrible rumor that you died. You always said I'd be the one to kill you. Uh, that wasn't very nice of you, to break a promise to your only sister. Unless there's another sister you didn't tell me about. So now you're not only dead, but you're a liar too. Tisk tisk. Anyways, I know you love to read, so I'll keep this short. Let me know if you're not dead so I can come over and hug you with my knife. Erwin. <laughs> wow, what a loving sister. Alright. Um, where's this taking me? Investigate Knife Point Ridge. That is over there. Alright. So if we go... If we go here and we'll ride Thunder into the mountains, then I think that'll work out great. I'm going to take a drink real quick. So I'm going to mute myself. Alrighty. Let's get back into this. Cross the bridge, and then I think... Yeah, we just hang a right. Let's see. Do we want to cross? All right, we're going to go up, and then there's like, it looks like a little dirt path right there between those this mountain and this mountain, so we'll take that. All right, keep an eye out for a dirt path. Is it that? No, we're not even fucking close. <laughs> All right, keep going. I want to see how long I can wait for it to not be foggy. I wish I had the clear sky shout. That'd be nice. Still foggy, man. This fog never goes away. We're going to wait here all goddamn day. Just dissipate, you stupid fog. There we go. Jesus. Nice and daylight out. No more fog. This is this is the Skyrim I love. Alright, I'm still looking for a dirt path. That sounded like a dragon. Alright, we're at the dirt path. Perfect. And there's the dragon. Quick save. I don't see the dragon, but I fucking hear it. I don't know if I'm down to fight another dragon. I mean, the last one wasn't that hard, but I feel like I did. Up to there it is. Hello. I don't think he's seen me yet. He's just kind of flying around. I did up the difficulty from last episode, I think. I think last episode I was playing on Adept, and I just bumped it up to Expert because i pretty sure I said a few episodes ago, game crashed. Are you fucking kidding me? Why? <laughs> Why does my game crash so fucking much? I don't even know where my last save... Oh, never mind. I know where my last save was. It was right when the dragon showed up. All right, so we're fine. We're, we're right there where we were, where we were. Hopefully it doesn't crash again. Come on, loading screen. Hurry the fuck up. This is supposed to be next gen. Oh, why'd you get off the horse? Grish Grishka. Grishka, no. I don't want to get off the horse. Do we face the dragon? Was that my game telling me I need to fight this dragon? I don't think it noticed I'm here. A lot of fucking deer around here. It's just circling me. What do you want? I don't have range. I can't get your attention. Is Thunder going to follow me? Yeah. All right. We'll just, we'll just start walking down this dirt path, I guess. This dragon's just going to fucking mind its own business. On the road again. 
Everyone's behind me except for Thunder. What is he doing back there? Am I getting close? Uh, not close enough. All right, we're getting back on Thunder. I'm just going to horse call this shit. Hello, Thunder, my beautiful ass horse. Let me make sure I switch back to that. I don't want to try to boost road off someone and then accidentally just get on a horse. That's always so disorienting. I do it all the time. What is that? Is that just a rock? Or is that a... That's a beehive. Why is there a beehive on the ground? That's not where that goes. Getting close. What am I going here for? Investigate Knife Point Ridge. I've, I, I can't remember. I've heard stories of bandits being an issue throughout Skyrim. At the dungeon in Whiterun, I read about one such bandit who died in Falkreath. However, arriving at the gravesite, I found a body of a dead Khajiit. So someone killed the... Oh, shit. Hello. Take care of that real quick. Don't want that coming back to bite me in the ass. Literally. Shit, all right, we got a lot of enemies up here. Quick save. I don't, am I, oh, they know I'm here. Well, shit. Where's Lydia? There you are. Lydia, with me. We got, we got to handle this like the professionals that we are. Which one, I bet they're going to drop the rocks before I get, even get close. Ah! Can I... I'm taking that away from Lydia. Ah! I'm gonna take that axe away from Lydia. So she's just making people run away. And that's not fun. I hate chasing people down. Oh, God. Lydia, we're getting wrecked by these boulders. Holy shit. Lydia might die. I can't lose another follower. I refuse. You leave her alone, damn it. I will kill all of you to protect Lydia. All right, Lydia, give me the axe. <laughs> oh, uh, behind you. <laughs> it's a bounty hunter. I'm going to quick save. Lydia, oh, Lydia, I need your help. All right, Lydia, fucking put in the work on him. Oh, I don't give a fuck if you yield, sir. Yeah, Lydia, talk your shit. <laughs> we got him. And I think we just got some Daedric armor, too. Holy shit. Daedric plate armor. We also got, that's awesome, Daedric gauntlets of eminent sure grip. Uh, increased shock resistance. Let's throw all of that on. Completed beyond the grave. Oh, dude, we got kitted. Fucking le level eight, episode what five, and we're already daydricked out. <laughs> that's I feel like that's cheating, but we'll roll with it. This this let's play is just for fun. It's not it's not anything serious. And hey, I got it with the quest. It's not a mod. I'm not cheating. It, it's a quest that came with anniversary edition. So, what can I say? When I leveled up, hell yeah. I feel like there's more bandits. Get this back out. Yeah, there's more. You won't have shit, dude. You just try to do that. My boots are shock resistant. Good luck with that. I'm nothing? You're dead. I feel like that's nothing. Is Lydia over here kicking ass? Yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. All right, I think that's everyone outside, unless there's someone down. Yep, hello. Hello. <laughs> Never should have what? I'm sorry, you didn't finish. Oh, shit, there's another one. Yeah, Lydia, just a scratch. You tell him. <laughs> Lydia's such a good trash talker. Way better than me. I just kind of mumble through my fights and not make any goddamn sense. 
I know this place is a Daedric. This location uh, is part of a Daedric quest, so I don't think I can really go deep into this mine. I think there's one bandit I can kill in here, though. And uh, we we'll, we'll might as well go ahead in here and take care of him. We're already here. Might as well kill him, take his treasure. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Level up. Just level up. Just, just fucking do that. Um... Uh, what am I using right now? I'm using a, I'm using a battle axe. Go ahead and do that. Lydia, where the fuck are you? I'm in here fighting for my goddamn life. What are you doing? Lydia, I can see you back there. You, what are you doing? Oh, oh, that hurt. Oh my god, and I'm dead. Lydia, why? Why aren't you helping me? You were sworn to defend me. You fucking liar. I'm not lost. This time you can talk to my friend. She really wants to say something to you. It's probably an apology about me, but... Lydia, fucking get his attention. He's only hitting me and it's not fair. <laughs> Got him. Jesus. There we go. What's a, a golden dag? Is that better than what I have? It is better. Yeah, good. give me that. Oh, yeah, it's pretty fucking sick. I uh, I don't know if I want to wear this Daedric armor, though. Let's see. I think we were wearing... We were wearing heavy armor, so... Was I increasing heavy armor? I guess I can go ahead and level up. Uh, yeah, go ahead and put it into that, and then bring it up to that again. Um, so let's see here. We were increasing heavy armor. We weren't doing anything for light armor. Savior's Hide is light armor. What does this armor do? We don't use illusion. So, like, the armor rating would be good. The effect isn't good for me. Let's see. The armor rating for this is 84. <laughs> this is 28. That's a big difference, if you didn't know. Um, this increases magic resistance and poison resistance, though. And it also looks pretty fucking tight. Let's go ahead and put this on. Let's live life on the edge. I look really stupid. What's the helmet do? Increases your health by 50 points. That's actually pretty cool. Um, and I was wearing this that does nothing. It looks good. It looks pretty fucking good. We'll keep this on for now. If, uh, if need be, we can switch. All right. Let's loot our, our treasure here. Ooh. Feet of Notorgo. Move 25% faster while concentrating. I'm not a mage. Otherwise, I would. Ooh. Ooh, we just got this necklace that basically defeats the purpose of wearing the Savior's Hide. Uh, where's the necklace? There it is. Increases poison resistance by 50%. It's exactly what the Savior's Hide does, except for the magic resistance. Huh. Although this just looks way cooler. I like the aesthetic. I don't think I need in here. There's nothing in there I really want. All right. Let's get the fuck out of here. All right, cool. We uh, we accomplished two quests. One that we started last episode, but at the very end. So I consider it doing pretty much the full quest in this episode. And then we did this little Creation Club quest, which uh, fucking got us kitted out with some Daedric armor. That's it's nice. It's a little early quest that you can do if you really want to get um, some good equipment. And it wasn't that hard either. I'm playing on Expert, and yeah, I have Lydia and a goat with me, but <laughs> they weren't really too much help. Ow! Motherfucker, I just got fucking kicked by another rock. Alright, uh, let's see here. What else do we have? I don't think I'm going to dive into another quest this episode, but I would like to kind of see where we're at. Uh, kill the bandit at all time Towers. Yeah, probably not. That's... Let's see, that's all the way over there, and we are 
all the way down here. Yeah, that's kind of far. Even if I fast travel, I would still have to like go from the stables all the way over here over there. That's like that's that's a bit of a hike. So I might just cut the episode kind of short today. Um Yeah, I feel like we got holy shit, more boulders. Oh my god. <laughs> They're coming after me. Thunder, watch out! No, oh, Thunder! I'm sorry. Are you okay? Uh, of course you're okay. You're fucking Thunder, the dope-ass horse of Grishka, the orc berserker. All right. Anyway, I'm going to cut the episode short. Um, I think we got a good amount accomplished today. We fucking got some Daedric armor. Got a Daedric artifact. And, yeah, yeah, it was pretty sweet. Um, so, yeah, if you enjoyed, please feel free to hit the like button and feel free to subscribe. I would appreciate either one of those. And I encourage you to comment down below any uh, any tips. If I missed anything, please feel free to let me know. And also let me know if there's any games you want to see on the channel in the future. I will take a look at them and consider playing them. Other than that, I will see you guys later. Peace out.